lining up outside, car after car. Whether you dropped off items, thank you, joined the package assembly line, or boxed up goods. Unbelievable turnout tonight. The community has been supporting us. The Ukrainian American Club in Southport says you're playing a role in getting critical supplies like this. Diabetic supplies to Ukrainians who have lost everything. We are only 40 minutes into our collection and it is overwhelming the generosity of the people of Fairfield and in surrounding communities. Once cars were unloaded, items were brought to this first tent. We have a new clothing. We have just a load of things for men, for kids, for women. Then they were sent into the ballroom to get sorted. Here are our school supplies. We're trying to keep those separated from um, this is medical here. The process was all hands on deck from start to finish, and organizers say the generosity was unexpected. Our number one thing that we're looking for really are medical supplies, and we just got this huge donation of syringes and gowns. Some even left heartfelt sentiments inside packaged items. We pray for peace for Ukraine. So it almost brings me to tears to tell you the truth. In times of crisis, people want to do something to help and there isn't always an avenue to be able to do that. Some people have the ability to give money, others don't. And so this is a way also of people being able to make a difference uh, through this initiative. In Fairfield, Shosh Pedrosian, News 12 Connecticut. The Ukrainian American Club will continue gathering those items.